It's me, your boy, K. Samson. I have something special for us today. You know, happy Sunday to all my amazing, beloved, chosen one. Happy Sunday. You know, it's a day that the Lord has made, and it is wonderful, beautiful in our side. You know, listen, I'm here to tell you, God is saying, you know, I have made it true. You are no longer going to be whom they do used to know before. <laughs> listen. Your family will not recognize you anymore. Let me just be real with us. Your family, your brothers, your sisters, your aunties, your nephews, your cousins, your friends. <laughs> ah, they won't recognize you anymore. <laughs> I don't care what they have said about you. I don't care what they have did. I don't care how long they rejected you. I don't care how long they abandoned you. I don't care how long therefore they make you look like you are a forbidden word forest. But I'm here to tell you, God is saying, I have done it. <laughs> it is over. For affliction will not rise for the second time. <laughs> it's me, your little boy, K. Samson. Listen, I don't get to know what they did. That make them look like you are no that that make them believe that you are nobody. <laughs> you know, sometimes when God is about to bless you, people will just first of all realize, and people will first of all look at you and say, "It's nobody." No, don't mind them. The way they take David as a what as a domestic staff. <laughs> no, let's be real. The brothers of Joseph, David, they are so wicked. <laughs> Imagine a whole man, not a woman. They said you should be David should become what a domestic staff in the home, <laughs> cooking and be, and bringing it to them to eat, taking care of fowl, goat, a uh, sheep, uh, uh, elephant, uh, grass cutter, uh, antelopes, even monkeys. This is all the work that they see that David can do. That means David cannot join them. To go to battle. So my brothers and sisters, I don't care who have already concluded you as a failure. I don't care who have already made up their mind and said you can't do it, you can't make it, you can't succeed. But all I have for you today, all that I have for you at this particular moment is that you, you are going to do what God have done it. And it will soon do what shock those who have made up their mind that you can't be like them. Yes, the truth is this. You can never be like them. <laughs> Let me just be real. Let me stand up. You can never be like them because you are greater than them. So my, what I, I bring for us today is that they have already concluded you. They have already made up their mind that you can't succeed, you can't make it. But I'm here to tell you that not only you making it, you are going, your life is going to shock them. Your life is going to shock many people who have already concluded you on your behalf. Many people who have already made up their mind that you can't do it, you can't succeed, you can't do well, you can't do great. Many of them, I'm here to tell you, God is saying, <laughs> that case is already rewrite. That when they see you yesterday, they will not be able to monitor, do or to view you with microscope. They will not be able to do or to locate you anymore because the story is already turning for your good. For the Egyptians they see yesterday. <laughs> hey, for the Egyptians they see yesterday, they shall see them no more. I don't get to know the trouble that they have seen in your life. I don't get to know where they have concluded you or what they have said. I don't get to know how many there are that said, hey, you can't succeed without us. You can't make it. And you, you, you can't be something without us. I'm here to tell you. <laughs> God said to Moses, He said, Moses, said to them, that the Egyptian they see yesterday, they shall see it no more. Said to the people of Israel, that the Egyptian that mocked them, that seen them yesterday, they shall see them no more. I'm here to tell you, I don't get to know who rejected you, who have forgotten you, but I am here to tell you politely, that who rejected you yesterday, they should not see you today anymore. I don't get to know who have spoken evil word concerning you, I don't get to know what they have did behind you, but the Bible says, Upon Mount Zion there shall be deliverance. For the house of Jacob must surely possess their possession. I don't get to know what they have said or what they have did. 
<laughs> Listen, God is about to shock people who have already made up their mind not to help you. God will, is about to shock them. Do, do not be troubled, for I am with you, says the Lord of hosts. Is there anything too hard for me to do? My brothers, who rejected you have made the worst mistake. <laughs> because they won't be able to watch you with a micro, microscope. <laughs> because the same God who did it for Esther, we also do it for you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So remember, blessed, may God bless you. And don't forget to subscribe to your little boy, King Samson. We remember the choosing. Remember, blessed.